today we are going to make um, breadsticks. Got my pancake mix here. So I'm going to need, let's see, maybe about, mm, I'll just say two cups. Mm, maybe three. Let's make it three cups of pancake mix. Three's really a good number. Okay, close that up. And to that, I am going to add some um, sea salt. Okay, about a teaspoon of sea salt. And let's see. Some of my butter complete seasoning. Now you can use this or not. It's up to you. If you have another seasoning, you can do that. I'm just going to give it a couple shakes. I like the seasoning. Um, it has garlic in it, onions, um, bay leaf, peppers, everything. Okay, I'm going to add about a teaspoon of parsley. I am going to add some garlic powder. Um, these holes are pretty big, so it comes out. There we go, about a teaspoon of garlic powder. You know I love my onion powder, so just a couple shakes like that. Probably about a tablespoon of onion powder. And some coarse black pepper. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight shakes. Okay, stir this pancake mix with my seasoning around. Now, if you wanted to make plain breadsticks, you could. These are just onion garlic breadsticks. Now, we're making a dough out of this, so I'm just going to drizzle a little bit of water, stir it around till we get our dough going. More and don't worry if you over pour your water, you can always add more mix to this. Okay, squeeze it as you go. Look, we're starting to get a dough forming here. Okay, add a little more. Okay, get it going around. Starting to form into a nice dough. A little more. Nice. Okay. Clean that bowl with your dough ball. Get all of that mix in there. Nice. Look at that. Look at that. See, it's not really sticking. Isn't that awesome? Now I've got my vegetable oil heating. Okay, so I'm going to move this bowl out of the way. Gosh, the last time I had um, any kind of garlic sticks was from a pizza place. Uh, you know, my favorites have always been round tables. <laughs> Those garlic twists. But these are going to be more like Little Caesars crazy breads. So I'm putting some pow, which you all should know by now is a little bit of flour on my surface. I'm just going to roll my dough like this. In it. Oh gosh, it smells good. I can smell all the spices I put in here. Okay. Nice. Push that flour out of the way. Okay. Okay. So I'm just going to grab a, a piece like that and roll it. Roll it. Put it on the counter. 
roll it. Now we can make twists if we want out of this, or we can just make, you know, roll it to where my hands, see how my hands are moving out the way? It's getting longer. You can always pull it some. Hey, back there. <laughs> just pinch it together. Roll it, roll it. Okay. So that's one stick. Here we go. Rolling it in my hands. Rolling it in my hands. Get it down. Roll it. Move it out. There we go. See? If it breaks, you can always pinch it together. Okay. So I'll be back as soon as I'm done rolling these. Okay, I had turned my oil off. At one point, it was getting very, very hot. And I want to tell you, you don't, if ever your oil is just too hot, you know, turn it off. You don't want any issues. Now, let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. I made, I rolled um, with my hands <laughs> twelve breadsticks, okay? Garlic, onion, breadsticks. So this has pancake mix, garlic, some parsley, and onion powder, and some sea salt in it. Now, my oil should be hot enough. I'm going to just stick it right in there. Okay. We want these to cook through. If they turn brown too quick, it obviously means that your oil is too hot, okay? You don't want it too quick. Now, the more you put in here, so you can kind of stretch it out a little, um, it'll take a little bit longer, but it helps to cool down the oil as well. It's too stick this real this small one in. Here we go. Okay. So there we go. Just turn them. Turn them when you start seeing them brown. These are wonderful. Now you can have these plain. You can um, dip them in any kind of sauce you want. This one needs a little more time. Um, any seasoning. Now these are garlic onion with a little bit of that vada seasoning, which, oh my gosh, it has, the seasonings in it are great. You know what I like too is steak seasoning. Oh gosh. You know, the red peppers. Just turn it. Nice. Okay. Turn it. Here we go. So my heat is on low. I'm going to turn it up to about a number three. Just to get them going a little quicker. <clears throat> so the three cups of complete pancake mix. Just add water. Um, I made 12 breadsticks here. So, you know, and the pancake mix is like what? $1.98. Now, if you go to Little Caesars or somewhere to get breadsticks, you are definitely going to pay at least what seven dollars especially if you want crazy sauce <laughs> so I'm just rolling these around get them nice and brown okay I will add oops it's okay if one look at that one broke but I'm going to just do this roll out <laughs> the piece that broke off Pull it a little, then we'll have another smaller breadstick. Oh, look at that. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. 
Who had gotten mail? <laughs> uh, does anybody remember when AOL was out? And you could pick which star's voice you wanted to announce your mail. Well, I picked Hugh Grant at the time. I would have preferred Rudger Hauer, but Hugh Grant it was for quite a while. Okay, this is a bigger, fatter one. So you can make these any shape you like, any, you know, width or... Or anything just turn them around kind of like how you would sausages isn't it funny how the Brits call it bangers <laughs> I always thought that was really funny bangers they look like bangers but they are garlic onion breadsticks uh-huh. Oh my gosh. Wonderful. Now if it's too brown for you and you prefer lighter, you can do them lighter. If you don't want any seasoning, you don't have to do any seasoning. It's entirely up to you how you want it. Now you could always turn the oil lower and cook it slower and get a lighter breadstick. I'm just hungry, so I turned up the oil. Um, oh, these are great. Ooh, ooh, hot, hot, hot. Okay. So far, breadsticks. Yummy. Okay. Turn them, turn them. Any kind of flavor you want. Mmm. Nice. Okay. Take them out. Sometimes I like to just add a little bit of table salt. Okay. And I'll be back. Now I am almost done here with these wonderful garlic onion breadsticks and I will be serving this with a homemade goulash and um, you must try these okay now if you don't like spices at all just get your pancake dough and um, put, add that salt because you don't it neutralizes the sweetness of the pancake mix Okay, so it's complete pancake mix, three cups, and a teaspoon of salt, and anything else you want, any other. Okay, if you want these garlic um, onion breadsticks, about a tablespoon of garlic powder, tablespoon of onion powder, um, tablespoon of parsley, and enough water to make a dough. I did not need a rolling pin for this. I just used my hands. Make sure that your oil is not too hot. If that they don't brown too quickly. And that's all you need for wonderful breadsticks. You can dip these in marinara. You can eat them plain. You can, you know, eat them with my homemade goulash recipe. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to turn off my oil. That's done. Let it drip a little bit. Oh gosh, she could smell these. Mm hmm. And there we go. Now, like I said, I like adding a little bit of table salt just to the outside. So let me see which one's not too hot. Um, hmm. They are hot. They are very hot. So I will break one in a minute <laughs> when they cool off. I've got one. Mm. I'm going to take a bite. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. This is so good. Okay. Breaking that open for you. 
Mmm. Excellent. You will love these. You can sop up your gravy, any kind of sauce with these breadsticks. Um, if you make pizza, you can add these breadsticks along with your pizza and dip them in that homemade ranch I taught you how to make. You will love these. Oh, yes. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Onion, garlic, breadsticks. You will love these. <laughs> Your family will love them. Oh, and remember always to do this in remembrance of the Lord whose body was broken for us. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise Jesus. Mm -hmm. Okay, God bless you, and I'll see you at the next video.